Hey, hi, my name is uh, Emmerich uh, with Driven Sounds and uh, I hope everything is alright with you and uh, today I will explain to you what is uh, this uh, template between machine, a native instrument machine and pre-sound studio ones. So what I can do, I can go back here and come back to um, the introduction page of uh, studio one. So I have here you will have this files this file sorry um i have the machine studio uh, one midi notes sound so it will be sounds to midi notes it sounds to midi notes means you will play the sounds from machine in studio one or or you will uh, drag and drop the the midi uh, patterns uh, from the machine in studio one so to do that the the first thing you have to do is we have to check is like when you, you click to this template I have done and you will you can purchase this template on drivensounds.com we have one track one MIDI track from machine 2 the other thing here and we have the 16 channel these are actually aux auxiliary channel because this channel um, will get you the uh, separate channels so you can mix again the track if you want to mix the tracks separately so how does it work so the first thing you have to really understand is that when you hear select something and you drag and drop or you double click you have to and i insist and select the plus routing because if you select the plus routing you will uh, bypass all the routing behind that so we have the routing right here and we have some other routing uh, routing uh in the machine so unselect the plus routing so by default it will be selected you just have to da double click or you know drag and drop as you do and when you do that the thing is you have to all the sounds here okay you can put the same bpm okay so you see you have all the sounds separated i don't know you can put uh, uh, an eq on this etc uh, etc et so th that's that's not an issue if you want to go like that you can but the really the 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 great thing with that template uh, is that you can drag and drop this information in midi okay so we have that you can drag and drop the information in midi and put it here on the machine on the pre on studio one sorry and you have exactly the same thing on studio one right now as the sounds is the sounds to mini notes so each note on the piano roll represents the sound okay you see so the thing is if each note represents a sound um, that means you don't have the keyboard functionality. So the keyboard functionality is basically put all the sounds and pitch, uh, pitch uh, each sound on the MIDI keyboard. That's actually what it means. But you don't have that here. So why would you want this template? So this template, you, you would want this, this template because you want the, to play the sounds. Okay, so the sounds coming from here, you want the template. Okay, the drums template not uh, the vil um, the melody template so the drums template or you want to play the sounds on studio one so first thing if you are done the drag and drop like I've, i did um if i play what happened here is that the you play the sounds in studio one and you play the sounds in the machine so you play the sounds twice so you what you have to do is like create a blank pattern now you have the sound played in Studio One, but nothing is done in the machine. Okay, so that's that's actually what we want. Okay, so what that means also is that means is if you want to play the sound in Studio in, in Studio One, you can you see if I put something like that, I can do that if I want. You see so i can do that i can play 
the sounds on Studio One and I can drag and drop the patterns on you know, from machine to Studio One. So that would be great if you like to play with uh, the drums on machine. That would be great great if you want to play with the patterns uh, in Studio One. So you, you have a ton of flexibility on drums. Uh, the thing you have to understand is like this is good but this will be good from only one group because if let's say i have a drag and drop the same thing here if i want here if i want to duplicate the track here so i have let's say channel 2 right right and i want to put that okay second one if i do something like that it, it doesn't work because actually we have to do something really quickly you have to put sounds to midi notes here and we have if we have the same thing here you see this is not working and the, the second thing here if i do that on the same track here So this is not working on two groups. So you will have to have one group when you work with this template. So what is the problem with that? Actually, there's not much of a problem because the thing is you, you will have to work with one group. And if you have your sounds, if you have your samples, or if you like the patterns, it will be okay. So actually I have another video and I have another uh, product with the uh, sounds to MIDI channel where you can have more than one group on this on this one. So if this one is okay for you, I repeat, this one is for people who like to play with drums. This one is for people who like to play with the pattern of a machine and don't want to have the problem with machine, you know. I can bounce in place, I can bounce the selection and, and get the selection in audio and everything is gone so i have the audio now okay so the thing is this template is great because you don't have to really uh have a headache to to place everything etc etc it's already been done now it's up to you so if you want the presets you can buy it on drivensounds.com and check for yourself so let me know see you peace